Hi guys! So, so this is the first reading for the thank you for 2k. This is for my BTS army. Look what arrived today! Yay! <laughs> I got my in the soup gift! Yoohoo! I paid like $20 just for shipping. <laughs> they are like free, you know, when you buy in the soup, but you pay like $20 for shipping, so oh yeah! Those cards I want to use for my channel, you know, look at them. Woo -woo. So what we're doing here, guys, look at those beautiful cards. You choose your bias or, you know, to whomever you're drawn, guys. And then um, I will give you the message, a message from one of the boys. You know, there is a message under that. And I'm also going to channel. You see this white paper? I'm going to channel afterwards. You know, when we're done with the reading, I'm going to channel a message. This will be like this page long. I'm going to channel. I write it down and I will upload that for my membership, people. Okay, so everyone who wants to join our membership, please um, look in the description box under each video. You can find the link to do that. Okay, and if you sign up for the daily readings, you will get the, um, yeah the channeling of the boys i channel each one of them what they have to say to this to this specific message okay it's not another message um we want to look what the message is from the boys and then i will channel to that message what they want to say more to that okay so if you are not a member and you want to know what they're saying then please sign up for that and for my members you just go to the membership you know so and thank you guys so much for 2k i can't believe it it's really cool we're growing and growing and i'm very happy and um yeah let's celebrate the 2k with our first bts reading and then i also upload a reading for the community but this is for our army here on my channel okay guys so let's start the reading so hi guys so welcome look at what arrived today isn't that crazy oh my gosh i love it what can i put in okay we look at the at the color so he chose this paper so maybe this um yeah this pattern means something to you those little blue flowers they look like forget me not that's like his energy, but universe was throwing them out, you know, so I will leave it there. So we will see his message to you guys. And later after this reading, I will channel him with um, the, you know, the BTS deck. And I will throw this reading on the membership. So please sign up if you have not already. Okay, guys? So Let's see, guys. A feather from Kim Taehyung. So this is the feather. So let's read what he's saying. It says hummingbird. Um, release what you've been carrying and lighten up. New joy is on the way. I want to put this here. You are not afraid. Okay, first I want to look at the cards, you know. We have the Six of Cups. And Justice. So let me tune in the energy is what he is saying. Mr. Kim Tae Young. So <clears throat> release what you've been carrying and lighten up. Okay, there's um there is an anxiousness, guys. You you are carrying. You are carrying nothing this than an anxiousness. Maybe you've overcome this, then you know you're already at the point where you um have overcome your um, fear 
But there is some kind of fear um, because you're facing a situation that's bigger than yours. You know, you have never faced this. This is like David and Goliath. You know, the story where um, David is battling with Goliath, a giant, and Goliath is a lot bigger than him, but David is using tricks in order to bring him down. And that's why even if you are the smallest being on earth, you know, and the task you're doing is something that is so much bigger than what you have ever worked on or, you know, a thing you have never done in your life, you still can overcome this. And Tiangi is saying, you know, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid to walk um, step by step. You don't have to be afraid of the journey. Put that fear away. New joy is on the way, that, you know. And when we have the Six of Cups here, this is for me, you know, this boy is with his dog all his life, growing up with his dog. You see them here as children and here they are grown up. So that means that you have emotional support. You have a good friend that's always with you. It could also be the Tangi saying, you know, he is your emotional support because that's his message, you know, that's what he wants to tra transport. So basically what I really feel is that you have a very good friend, you have emotional support, you are cared for, you know, you, you can lighten up. You can, don't really need to be afraid because there's also justice, you know. And it's to face your fears. Look how she looks in the mirror. And me, I mean that that mirror self is a little bit scary that looks there. So that means uh, face your fears, you know, face your fears. You can do it. You have the emotional support. You will overcome anything. Don't be afraid, you know, even if the thing what you're working on right now um, in school or, you know, in your love life or at home, that doesn't matter because this is a general reading. It can apply to anyone. Basically saying, you know, free yourself from the fear because you can, you can face your fears. You can walk through that because I'm with you, you know, and you have the emotional support. Beautiful, right? So this is Tiangi's message. Thank you for 2K guys. Please always like the video because you see that it really, really helps to find the people that have to be on our channel. So thank you very much for everything. And, um, I'm very happy guys, you know, to do these readings for you and um, please check out his message in the membership that I do after this reading and um, yeah guys, really happy you're here on my channel, okay? See you at the next reading, bye! So hi everyone, so next up is our Gemini. Look at these beautiful pictures, they are see-through, really like them. Okay. This is the, <laughs> I don't know why he chose that um, for channeling, you know. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, I don't know, he chose that paper. So we're gonna channel him after that reading. And the channeling is uploaded in the membership, guys. So please sign up for my membership. The link to that you will find under each video, okay? So now we see his message. Where is... Oh, do I only have... Oh, okay. Okay, so we have... the Oh, the feather from Germany is this one and you've already seen... <laughs> I was looking if I have all the cards. It says, Eagle, you are learning all aspects of spiritual connection and reaching new heights. That's beautiful. So it feels like you're Eagle, you're ascending in your spirituality, you know? So let's see what the cards here are. Share your gifts. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. The world. Wow. So I want to put it like this so you can see it. Yeah, I want to get one more tarot card. I don't know why I have only one in all those piles and Taeyang had two. <laughs> What's going on here? I get another card. Can you give me one card? What do you mean here? Yep, 
being enlightened. We put this here in so. Okay. So guys, basically it's saying, um, since you're here on my channel and probably before too, um, you know, you are learning of spirituality, you are learning of spiritual connections, you have a spiritual connection with with someone, guys, um, you know, and you're soaring for new heights, you're reaching new heights. It's like an ascension, you know, you have worked hard on yourself and this is also what the hangman says, you know, the hangman is, um, you know, you could be Pisces, guys, because hangman is um, usually said to be Pisces from the zodiac sign, but it doesn't have to be, you know. If you look at this, he has an epiphany, you know, the hanged man. It's like he sees things from a new perspective. So what I feel is that since you found my channel or since you find found Germany, that generally and you, you found the spirituality, it's like you had this epiphany, you know. This is like an awakening for me, an awakening. Maybe you awakened when Shimin came into your life and now you're balancing out and the world is always a completion of a cycle. You see how the cycle is over? A healing cycle. So there are many healing cycles in our lives, you know. And you have just completed one. That's why Gemini is saying you're soaring up to new heights, you know. And now it's time to share your gift. See, we have the six and the two. That's life path number eight. So maybe you are life path number eight. And it's about sharing your gifts, you know, sharing your spirituality with other people, you know, show them my channel, like go to your friend and show them my channel. Maybe if you all, um, you know, watch my channel, then you can talk about these things and you can talk about spirituality. It's, you know, it's about sharing. It's about sharing. And also if you have special gifts, for example, if you can talk with your friends very good and you can advise them, do that, Gemini is saying, you know, please do that. That's that's really, really beautiful. So I'm going to channel a message to that situation for you guys and I will upload it on the membership channel. So, okay. You guys can go there and watch this and sign up for the membership. Okay, guys, bye. So hi, next pile. So now we're with Cookie. This is so cool. I really love this card because it just arrived today. And Cook chose for channeling this kind of paper. <laughs> I really like that how they everyone chose their own paper. So I'm going to channel on that one a message from him later with um, my BTS tarot deck. You will see that, you know, I make a video and I will upload this video on the membership channel. This is a special message to that pile. So if you feel drawn to that, please sign up. It's only a 99 cent a month and you get every day a reading. Okay, guys, an additional one. So a lot, a lot of readings for you guys. So what is his message? That's the feather from Cook. And he's, oh, owl. Your intuition is correct. Follow your inner wisdom without fail. So you're very wise, guys. I mean, the owl is speaking that you can really follow your intuition. You can really follow what you feel inside, you know? You can really follow that. That's so beautiful. I really like this. Wow. Let's see what else he's saying. Oh, reach out. The seven of cups. Yeah. Um, you're confused about a choice, guys. You're confused about a choice. Should you reach out or not? I think that's the point. Yeah. It's about reaching out or not reaching out to someone. Let me get one more message, one more card. Yeah, someone where you had a fight. Someone that went where everything went downhill. Okay, so I feel here an ex or a friend that you broke off. Like you, you, you are not in contact with that person anymore because look at the war. There was like a war scene here I'm seeing. And there was change number five. So there was something going on and you're thinking about, should I reach out to that person, you know, or not? Because it feels like one of you is immature and the other one is like a parent. You see this? I mean, that's the situation. It's like a, like a little kiddo and a parent. 
So maybe you want to help that person. Maybe you are the parent and you want to help to that person. And Cook is saying, you're very wise. You know what you have to do. Your intuition is correct. So if this speaks to you guys and you had a fallout with someone in your life, it doesn't have to be a romantic situation. It can be a friend too. But you had a fallout with someone. And it feels like there's an age gap or there's a gap in maturity here. Okay? You know what to do. Because Cook is saying you have it all in your gut. You know what to do. Follow your inner wisdom without fail. You won't fail if you follow your inner wisdom. That's beautiful, okay? So I channel a message to that later on with my BTS tarot decks. And you can watch this on the membership channel. You know, you just go under every video. There's the link where you can sign up. Okay, guys? And thank you for being on my channel. Thank you for 2K. Spread the word of our channel, okay? Bye, guys. So hi everyone, next up is our Juni. Look at him, I really love those pictures. They're so cool. So Juni chose for channeling, he chose this card, those flowers, okay, maybe they speak to you. So I will channel him later to that situation here. I will ask for a message that I write down and I will read that and show you the pictures that I've drawn from the BTS tarot deck. Um, but I will upload this on the membership. So all my members are happy now. <laughs> they get another reading. If you haven't signed up, please do that and you can watch those messages. Okay, that's Juni's feather. Okay, he's saying, Pelican, choose to follow the path of forgiveness and raise your vibration. Okay, something was going on where you maybe overreacted because we have here clean up your mess so in the seven seven and the three you could be 37 years old but i don't think so the the um, three and the seven equals up to 10 so there was a new start there was a new start something you messed up and i see three people here a squirrel what is this maybe a pelican a bird and a, um, a rabbit so maybe you messed up a friendship guys because I feel here that this is like a group of four people belonging together I don't feel this is a connection a relationship or something why is no Jin we do later <laughs> yeah we have death and rebirth so there was um, a death situation a death situation means ending I also see this in the three and the seven I mean that's Let's make some lighting. I'm, I'm sitting here in the dark. Um, there was some death. You see this here? There was an ending in your life with a group of people. I feel here you are a group, group of four girls or four friends. There was a fallout. And it says death and rebirth. So that means, you know, if the death is coming, there will also be a rebirth. Meaning um, even if death is there if you clean up your mess and you forgive yourself you know you can start with them all over can i have another message for that yeah I, you could be a fire sign um sag leo or aries guys and you have turned your back up on those friends you know maybe because of a love situation Maybe because of a love situation, you had a fallout with your friends. Because, or it could be because of a king of wands. Maybe you are in love with the king of wands. And because of that, something else with your friends had to end. Or a king of wands, um, one of these is a fire sign. And because of that person, you know, they mobbed you or something. And maybe that's why they turned you, their back on you. So please take it as it resonates. But I feel here one person very dominant and just saying, no, I don't want this anymore and ending this friendship here. But what I see here with the tarot, it's rather that they say, clean up your mess. So I really feel that you turned your back on, the, on your friends. You ended this because of 
maybe a love situation, maybe they treated you unfairly, but the universe is saying, you know, you should clean up, you should forgive, and you should go back. It's on your end, okay? That's a very interesting pile because um, I need to channel Juni to see further into the situation here because um, th this could be anything, you know? We have to see what Juni is saying to this further, okay? So please join me over at the membership, guys, okay? Bye! So hi, now we are with Jin's message for you guys and he chose this paper. Look at this. Oh, it's purple! That's so cool. So he chose this design for his letter that I channel after this um, reading. I channel him and his what he wants to say to this um, further into the I go further into the matter matter with my BTS tarot deck and I will upload this reading on the membership channel that means please go under every reading there's the link where you can sign up for this you know so let's see his feather so he has a goose feather Jin's feather is a goose feather your dreams and desires are calling you to action. The journey begins today. So Dr. Jin, or how I say consult Jin, is saying, get up. You know, start your dreams. Yeah, look at this. There's a decision that has to be made, a fair decision. Look at this. This is a lawyer. Maybe your dream is to become a lawyer or to practice law, you know, because we have here a lawyer. Your dreams and desires are calling you to action. The journey begins now and today. So this could also be a father personality that helps you to decide. Let's see what this card is all about. Yeah, that's a decision. You're like juggling. You don't want to make a decision. There's something about a dream of yours. You have to make a decision in order to move forward. And you need to make the decision now. And it needs to be a just outcome, a just situation, a just decision. You need to, um, you know, it's not that one can be up and one down. It's not a situation that you choose which one is the best. You choose on which path. Both of those things are balanced out because this is Libra. So maybe you could be a Libra too, but... Guys, you need to find where both of these things that you juggle right now could be two jobs. It's not that one you throw away and you just keep one. You you look for decide the outcome means decide on a on a fair, on a just outcome where both of these things are equal. Can I have another card for that? So let's see what Tarot is giving me. Yeah, make a wise decision. Look at this you are passionate about both of those things those even could be two people guys you know you are basically this means you are very emotionally involved in this whatever you're juggling it's an emotional journey for you too and you should decide wisely because it affects your family there's something about children here so maybe it's about um, caring for your children and work or being a babysitter and going to college you know but you need because you're passionate about both things you need to make a decision that juggles them like on the same level okay so i will ask chin in the channeling what this is all about because this is very interesting i want to go further into this detail with him whatever he has to say to this okay guys so go to my membership channel, sign up. It's only 99 cents a month, okay? And you get a free reading every day, an additional one. Okay, bye guys. See you. So now we're here with our young girls. <laughs> so he chose this paper, beautiful blue flowers. So I will channel him on this paper later with my BTS tarot deck. And, um, you know, I will upload this channeling to this situation. So if you um, later on in the on the membership channel. So please look in every video. There is the link to my membership. You can sign up for 99 cents a month and you get a free reading every day. Another one, an additional one. OK, so it's not that expensive, but it would help me a lot on my channel, you know. 
So, um, and I will go further in detail into this situation. So we're having here a feather and it says Blackbird. That's the feather from Jungi. It says the magical and unique qualities of yours or of your untapped potential are unfolding now. Okay, so there's potential you have not even realized, you know, the blackbird. That's like a gift. You know, this reminds me of Game of Thrones, this crow. Um, that's like a gift, you know, that suddenly explodes in someone, that suddenly comes out in someone. So maybe you just noticed, um, yeah, call your spirit home. So, yeah. So I really feel that here you transitioned, you know. The five and the seven, that's a 12. So um, that's the communication with the spiritual world. So I think you realize that you have a gift inside of yourself. Then maybe you're like me, you know, you can communicate with spirits. So <clears throat> your spirit just got home. You know, that means your home is your body, your mind, everything, yourself, your soul. So um, your soul got enlightened, you know. There was something that you noticed that finally um, came out, you know? Yeah, look at this. It was hidden before. This is a hidden gift that was into in your intuition. You have a very, very high intuition. I feel that you can sense people's emotion. I feel that you can sense ideas that people have. It's like you can sense what they want from you. Yeah, and this is deep hidden in your unconsciousness. This is a gift that came out with a bang right now, you know? Beautiful. <clears throat> so you're just seeing how this is developing. I, I'm getting another card. Oh my gosh, yes. You are a spiritual teacher, the Hierophant. Yes, you're like me. You know, we're all spiritual teachers. And most of us come to my channel in order to develop their gifts. And whatever you do in the future, you know, spiritual gifts can be anything. You can just, um, you know, advise your friends. Yeah, so you are a spiritual person. Very beautiful. So go on a membership and we will see what comes out when I channel Jungi to that, okay? Bye guys, see you. So last but not least is our cute Hobi. So let's see what Hobi chose. <laughs> Hobi chose this cute um, paper for channeling later. So I will channel him later. And um, I will use my BTS tarot deck and I will channel him to the situation here. Whatever he has to say more about this, you know, and um, please go to the membership channel if you want to watch that reading later on. You need to sign up to be a, a member of our channel. It's only 99 cent a month. Okay, so wow. So Hobie's saying put others first. First, we want to read the, um, the feather from Hobi. Turkey, so maybe you're from Turkey. I had this feather coming up before. Honor your own time of harvest. Offer your gifts and blessings as service to the greater good. Wow. See, you people are all like me on this channel. It's very interesting to see that you're all very, very spiritual people. And uh, you develop your gifts here on this channel, you know. And it's very interesting, guys, because you all have a soul task. We as a community, we have a soul task to teach people about spirituality. And I really feel that, um, you know, you're developing more and more this gift. And the turkey is also about nurturing others, you know, like Hobi is doing, you know, nurturing others, offering the blessings for other people, you know, helping here. You see, like in the circus of the world, you know, balancing, helping people balance their tasks. That's what I see. I mean, if we are um, spiritual teachers, we help people to balance their everyday tasks because of our counseling. You know, people are happy when we counsel. So you don't have to be a tarot reader. You know, you can be just as simple as an advice for f giving advice on WhatsApp for friends, you know, or on Twitter. This is also already a spiritual helper, you know? Oh my gosh, the sun in a holy reading. Isn't that... <laughs> I haven't thought about this. This is cool because I, I don't see the cards 
you know look at this beautiful with the sunflower that's so beautiful yeah look at how this how spirit is enlightening you look at how spirit is um like speaking through you you know helping people um let's get another card for this yeah look at this the nine of cups i think you have reached you have reached a state in your life where you're very happy i see that guys i mean you're hobby biased and you're like hobby you're the sun you're very shiny um you know you're very you have found happiness in your life just because you live just because you could be an aquarius like hobby you know um or leo because the sun sign is, speaks also for leo but what i see here is you you spread happiness and that's one of the most perfect gifts that also helps you know you find happiness if you put others first you realize when you do that when you help others you know <clears throat> you have everything you want you know you're very happy and content i feel you're a very happy and content person so this is a very very beautiful message here very beautiful honor your own time of harvest so there will be a lot of wish fulfillment coming for you guys because you are like this you know so i will channel hobby's message to that later on so please go to the membership and sign up for this you know and then you can also watch his message that's beautiful i really love this okay so that's what i'm having guys bye guys <laughs>